not you don't like gays? Do you not, have something against gay people? No, I just love the word faggot a lot. And I've already been <laughs> and I've already been cancelled. I love retarded faggots. I'm, I have a, I'm in a, I have to, I'm starting a, a, a band and I like literally need a black person because there's so many N words in rhymes that have come to my mind, but it's only, you know, it, it is totally fine. It's totally fine. Just do what you think is right in your heart, man. Just follow your heart. If you want to start a rock band when you scream the N word, I'll be looking in that with you, I think. JP. Not, 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 a, no, not a rock. JP loves screaming the N word. It's a rap band. A rap band. You know what the killer you, you know what the killer app is? It's fucking You know what the killer app is? The killer app is killer rap. In VR, killer rap is the killer app. What can I say? I mean it's about very, very high level conversations. I mean you do get more points if it rhymes all the time. But it's about human intelligence. Like long before AI has its time, like human intelligence will step the fuck up. Some of us, some people that I have been around in my life can simulate uh, cooperative human intelligence by themselves. But it's much better if you have like a thousand other bright people, you know, high. It, it, it's very hard to do. It's very hard to simulate like 80,000 people all focused on a problem. I did it for the last 25 years, but like I had to do every hour. I didn't have 80,000 people. I had to do every one of the 80,000 hours. But in one day after I publish, like more work will be done than I did in my whole life. One day. And then they'll find out how bright they really think I am, which is a lot brighter than I am. I'm Uncle Sam, I am. But I could be in here by myself. That's how you win Camelot. You literally, every motherfucker leaves. Everybody leaves. 12 angry whatever the fuck um i say discordance like the word discordant is a word and discord is a trash word and a discordant is like a tiny little human ant a human if you will and i found out that i was the president of the words i'm done See, I, just, I, I just did a trump but i will literally hand the mic back to the no one that's left in this room because i fucked up and yeah i witnessed nice try my uh one, one million, one million D's. If you can tell me, you know what a D's is? No, a D, a, a D period E. No, it's not post-traumatic uh, dollar equivalence. That's not PT. Wait, post-traumatic stress dollar equivalence. A D's is a dollar equivalence. Like whatever a dollar's worth now, if I say you get a D's, you get a dollar at, at, at its current value. With you know, so it's it's like connected to the moment when you actually were appropriately thanked for your service. Thank you for your servers. Thank you for your service and thank you for your cervix and I'm surreal by the way. My name is Surreal. No, no, no. Not screams. No, but you could be a white dude. You can be a white dude, and you can have songs where there's a pause. Gets harsh. 
Uptown, B19. Coming with the dirt, with the blade on me. Is it cheating if I have a device, like if he reads his own lyrics or somebody else's lyrics, if it automatically transcribes that shit right in front of me? That's fine, right? Like you could, like if you're not in a face-to-face -face battle or a war, it's fine, right? Like, cause I, I hear it's people, I hear people rap and I hear some stuff and I like stuff and there's other stuff I hear and I'm like, oh, there's just a better fucking word, right? I just, <laughs> if you change one word in this freestyle, it's better and some change a hundred Maybe it's like an all-time goat but shit. They mean different things, bro. Yes. Deeper, yes. Bro. Absolutely. Everybody's. I don't hurt you, but I wish you were a better person. The same Thanks rap. The bad. same rap song means something different to fucking everyone. And every great rap song, if a person was really conscientious and went through it, they would change something in that song before they died. They'd be like, "I love that song, but I I thought of better lines in my own mind and on my blockchain for my sure, children." There, there. Literally songs that they're saying certain words and they're talking about synonyms for literally other words and that Spotify and shit show other words that like throw people off. I mean it happens by accident too. I make up Just words all the time. To a song, and when you listen to a song straight up, don't dive into listen to I don't listen at all. I mostly just listen to beats and, and write. I'll throw you I'll throw you one in a syllabus though if I have to. And you shouldn't throw people under the bus anyways. You should throw them the fuck in front of it, right? Like, half of all half of all cliches are actually backward. And even most, even the average American is not fat enough that being thrown under the bus is going to cause their spine or their stomach to be ripped off. Like, in front of... I, I don't mean to bring the short bus in, but I thought, you know, you two would appreciate that. Have you ever... The dude who was rapping, do you ever... Do you listen to yourself much? Because I have, like, no rap voice yet, but I need one. Right, I need one, and I know that I'm sure you sound better to me than you sound to yourself. Right, like do you like do you think about like how you change your shit when you're actually rapping? Right, like it's a different fucking voice that you're speaking in. Like, do you evolve that, or did you just like one day when you started fucking around with rap, just that was your voice and that was it, or do you are you gonna keep changing that shit? Because I think it's kind of like you have a decent voice, better than mine, but I still think you could you could work on it. Like, listen to yourself a little more and get to the point when you're like fuck i like but when you're not self-critical you get to the point you're not self-critical and then i think you got the right voice i don't know i don't know if it works like i'm gonna go from scratch like no voice i'm like my parents are from clarence i'm from the fucking suburbs i'm like the one of the pinkest people one of the most advantaged pussies in the history of the world like whatever like whatever shady is i'm the opposite of that but it, but but, in, but if it's just rap, if it's just the game, it doesn't matter. There's literally nothing to be afraid of. Like I'm not I'm not Biggie. I'm not Tupac. Nobody's gonna fucking shoot. There's nothing to be afraid of. It's just, it's like fucking art and business, right? That's all it is. It's all like and pussy, and and McLarens and Zeppelins and like. I mean, I assume you guys aren't rich. I like you know you're probably like relatively normal people. I just don't know if I could deal with that. Then again, you're young, so fuck it. Like when when you're young, it's easy as fuck. Oh, this is like the least unintentional, least intentional uh, podcast I've ever recorded. It's fucking weird. <laughs> Molly's kind of funny though. I don't know. That's a, like that dude's got such an interesting, strange voice that like like I think I I didn't even. I was just like, yeah, I like this guy. He's cool. I'm a voicist. Like, chicks are hot. I think they're smarter than they are. Dude's got a, like a, a, a character voice. I like that more than people who don't sound as good. Does Molly rap at all? Because he does have, he is a character, and he does have an, an interesting voice. And, like, my whole HBO special, I just stand on stage and get the fuck ripped out of me by 420 people who know me. And I do, ideally, I don't say a fucking word. Like... <laughs> I don't say a word. Molly will probably say some gay shit if he, <laughs> he usually says some like gay shit. And I have no idea if he's serious and I don't care, but it's pretty funny. And it doesn't matter if nobody's here. Like it just doesn't, it doesn't. In fact, if nobody's here, then I can probably go talk to John and Andy and Steve and, and these other people and uh, Peter. My friend Peter's over there. Peter is, is uh, I think, transgendering. Uh, I think that's what, like what Peter's doing is um, going from 
the, the predominant thing, which is going from being a, a man into being a woman. And in either situation, like, and this is crazy, Peter is like facially more attractive than I am. Not that I'm super attractive, but like more as a, as a man or as a woman. That's fucking weird. And I, th I didn't know transgender man is a thing, which just means like Minecraft. It's a, a, a transgender character in Minecraft. Don't know if transcendence is a thing. I don't have all the transfers. I'm not into Santa and owls and prancers and antlers. Oh, it's Dr. Draco. Dude, this dude, if you were here now, if I had the right cameras, like, Dr. Draco is a fucking ho This is the dude yesterday. Who <laughs> said? Pass. If you can let your cigarettes go out, you're probably much closer to quitting. If you just let them go out, it's probably the greatest thing. Just let them, even just let it take a hit. Let it go the fuck out. And then pour some, get in a medically induced coma like Luke Skywalker and pour the shit into your lungs and magnetically suck the fucking tire out. Or you just go cyborg. You go to the cyborg organization. <laughs> the cyb. I'm so high. It's so good that I'm not driving. It's like so good that there's a spot in the village idiots and they might say um you're the village idiot no in the room. i'm in the room recording a fucking like the, the the whole point is that all more or less normal people leave that's kind of like and I didn't realize, I realized that like seven times in my life, but today is another time. I don't, you don't, if you have anything to say, you don't need a fucking audience at the moment. You, you just don't. If you need an audience, you're, you're performing more than you're creating. And I mean, I get it. But there is someone in the room. There is someone in the room. I mean, there's me. And at the moment, there's you. But like, it's a funny thing to say, right? There's, that's like, I might put that on one of, it might be like the 1441st shirt. Like, there's no one in the room. Well, then how the fuck did you just say that? And how the fuck am I here? Because, like, there's somebody in the room. As in, I'm not nobody. Or if I'm nobody, at least I'm not no mind. I appreciate your service, though. That was, that was, that was a good line. Like, concise, there's no one in the room. That's a classic. Thank you. I like it. I like it a lot. I have no FOMO, Hamid. I'm like, I'm not afraid. I'm, I could get killed for making like Muslim portmanteaus. It'll, like, it, like there's like a 0.1% chance that some extremist fucking kills me one day for making jokes that include Muhammad's name. Uh, that, I don't think that's a big cause of death in the US. <laughs> No, no, it's not. But if you're like, if I were to publish something and it was very successful, and like they're like, this dude's making these jokes, like, and and they're you. What do you do? What do, you do? Uh, I invent shit, and more and more over the years, instead of writing about it uh, or drawing anything, I just started talking to people about it. Because it took me 25 years to do the work that I do, which is invention, but. The goal is to like open source everything in in science fiction or what I call pre pre science fiction, and if it works well enough, sell so many copies of the story that when when the people realize that those books are literal, absolutely literal stock and citizen certificates that that govern my company, like will be just under the the ultra unicorns like like i think it'll be a, a, a y-o unicorn days after publication if i do the right thing like i mean look at look at fucking look at bitcoin it's even now it's still probably worth like 800 billion just for an idea and it's insane like i have 1400 i like i love satoshi and 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 i like ben Fry. i like people who give shit away I like people who you know do things anonymously i love it sorry i'll just i'll go on forever Yeah, um, it's that 
I have an opportunity, and if I don't take it, I'm a part of it is that I have an opportunity. It was given to me, if not forced upon me. And if I don't take it, relatively speaking, I'm a piece of shit. Like, no matter what I would do, I would be, relatively speaking, incredibly selfish if I didn't try tanium. And even risk tritanicking. Like, I, 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 I was like, I was given a life by some other people that was like almost Buddha like. It was so different from what's what it is for most people in the world in the real world. So uh, instead of it being the real world, I was like I just had like kind of sto like a story, you know? And everybody has stories, but if you're if you're more in the real world, you probably realize earlier on and shit that like those are stories, you know? You don't have to be like, "I I fucking renounce Catholicism or I renounce fucking Judaism." Like just you kind of like it kind of goes away a little bit. I kind of believed in those stories until I didn't. And then I realized, holy shit, our stories are horrible. <laughs> like, we have good dystopian stories. We do not have good utopian stories. And they don't have to be boring. Like, mad shit can happen. Utopias can be destroyed, right? It's still a utopia. If an asteroid hits a utopia, it, like, it's still a fucking utopia. Or at least it was until the, as until the asteroid hit it. The problem is, dystopias are a joke. They're easy. If you want to write an actual utopia, the only way to do it, like 100%, is for it to be an intentionally self-fulfilling prophecy. It's like a story of a utopia that's so good that so many people buy the story even before they realize that the author is not keeping that $90 million, right? They're just building a prototype of something called, say, communications or community university, com university. And the author's like, I don't need any money. Like, if you only, like, if if my book only makes, like, a million dollars, I will keep all the fucking money. Like, I'm going to keep all the money. If it makes ten, all of the money is going to go into a trust fund, and everyone who owns a copy of my book is going to get to basically tell me what the fuck to do via direct democracy. I'll get to talk to these motherfuckers, but I will not get to tell them what to do. And, and I, I actually, considering Musk's re recent actions, I, def I actually think I'm above, mu above Musk when it comes to the fucking size and speed of my mind. But still, without human intelligence, building something amazing rips the fuck out of a human being's brain. Like, if you can find a hundred or a thousand or ten thousand people that by some measure are better or, or more dedicated or more unselfish or more honest, some, some, they have some good qualities in the demographic then you can completely abdicate from the idea of needing anything like a CEO or a king ever. And, and if you do have one, it's literally probably just someone like me, but a hundred times more calm who has no votes and just literally talks with the people and maybe makes speeches, maybe really passionate speeches when he's afraid that, that, that the people that make up this private sector democracy experiment are going to do the wrong thing. But the only power he has is, is to, like, make a speech. It's just to speak uh, to, to, to the otherwise sheep. It's been done, Franklin. Do you want to play basketball? Nah. No? I'd rather do a podcast. Like, I mean, if we had a good court on a nice night and it wasn't right now. Not now, but this there's, there's something. We could play somewhere, but... You're going to have to either tell me now or text me the only and best name for the ultimate Supre uh, worldwide franchise. Basketball courts. What are they called? Pro what are they called? It's uh, quid, quid pro, quo, pro quo versus wait. It's not all quid pro quo. I, I want to do, I, I am totally fine like without you talking to me i love you and and you could do great work but i don't need you right do you need me we see each other like eight times a year there's zero need there's just brotherhood and friendship and that's it like i don't need you we don't need you we would like you if you're the kind of person if you're an uber kind if you know what the fuck uber kind means in your own mind in your own way from your own perspective and you appreciate that shit like if you understand that like i mean all children matter right all of them, and that we must respect our kids, not our parents. I love the Jews. But, and they inspired me to write a story that people believe, even though it's not even real. You're losing me, Alex. Good. Good. <laughs> Leave. It's fine. It's all good. If you're all I'm gonna, good. I'm going to be inside. It's all good. I like, to, I like to play basketball by myself because then I can 
run back and forth while they're playing games with yeah. music and I can film it like and I mean we could do it but you'd probably have to bend a little so that like whatever I did don't no, say I'll tell you what I do if you want to do that I'd be happy if you want to be like no Alex I have like five idiosyncrasies of my own on the court I'd be like well, we're not gonna match up we'll figure it out I don't think we will we I think we will die not having figured it out Mr. Bestiality <laughs> It's not funny. Like how much, like, what if you were Mr. BCLD? Like, how much less bad is it, like, to fuck a sheep versus, like, it's not, it's, it's gross and fucked up, but, like, I don't think if they found out that Jeffrey Epstein was fucking sheep, that they necessarily would have hung him <laughs> or let him hang him. His name of Jeff. It's gonna like ruin the name Jeff for all future history. <sighs> Dr. Draco. I don't wanna get Ray banned. Wait, I'm in a fucking server, which is fucking hilarious. Let's see, I don't go into these other servers. Let's see. I do assume this, um, I assume that if nothing else, at least everyone in this place is always fucking high. <laughs> Dr. Draco! What's up? What's up? What's up, baby boy? Baby boy? Yo, come here a second. Say it to my face. Yeah. I'm not playing any you hands. I'm not playing any hands. I just chill. You gonna give me what I want? Chill. You gonna slap me across the face? Chill like vanilla. I like that shit. Isis. Chill like vanilla Isis. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> yeah. Um, nothing. How you doing? Good. <laughs> like, good. I'm glad that I don't have to drive right now, though, because, like, one hit is fine. I'll drive. Two hits, I get real. <laughs> no, I hate driving. I get really high, and then like, I'm like. Curious, anyway. It's a bitch. You know, I drive to, uh, from New York to Chicago from time to time. It's a bitch, bro. 60 Dude, hours, bro. I want to get on the road. Yeah. I want to get in an electric. I want to have a semi that's electric and transforms to some degree. I'll show you. You know what it's going to look like? It's going to look something like this. Semi tractor trailer, but like, I call it a super convertible, convertible industrial recreational vehicle. When you're driving on the road, that shit is tight, right? When you're not, I mean, these are the strong pieces, right? They open up, they open give you a big floor area, this is where you do like your comedy or music, this is where you live, batteries in this motherfucker, like, beast batteries in this motherfucker, stop it, <laughs> Sorry. retard, Sorry. I didn't know you had all this shit, this is what, this is what I would want, this is from music, I used to write like this, for funny shit, like this is the name of my, my book, look at that, how many words is a name, now it's just fuck jobs, it's the name of my book, fuck jobs, my name is Steve Works. Nice to meet you, Steve. Steve Works. Steve Works. Right, right, Fuck right. Jobs. jobs. Fuck right, Jobs, Steve, Steve Works. works. Right, right. I have so many funny names that I'll probably die without publishing them. <sighs> so when did you become so half gay anyways? Just happened on one day or like a quarter? You just probably want to get as much sex from pretty people or something. It's fine, I understand. But what's with like... I guess, actually, you know what? I don't know. It's a chain of metal. Is that for working out? Nah. Cause like, you don't ever wear like heavy it's chains? Just, uh, like, it's just, you know. I always wanted, I had a few Cuban links in my life. I like Cuban links. What well, down, guy? How you feeling, guy? Hampton just bailed out on me yesterday. Sorry, I was like. <laughs> Marco, what's I, up? Sorry, I, I was looking for you earlier, but I, I didn't see you, so. Where, where were you at? I don't know, I, I just, I, honestly, I've, I've been hitting up the bar, so. Yeah? I was just, like, walking around. Why don't you dance? Dance? What, what do you mean? Like, start actual dancing dance? In the, yeah, start dancing in the shower, get comfortable just dancing, whatever. Yeah. Find your own little mark dance. Yeah. You know, and I, then just go out and dance. I, One dance, and shut the fuck up. You're like me, if you talk, you're going to yeah. no pussy. 
Oh yeah, you yeah. Have to just dance. You're a good-looking guy. You're built. Just yeah, dance. You know, you know you'll what? Get, I, I, psh, babies, you'll be popping out babies. You'll right, right. That, that, <laughs> Can't get yourself in too much trouble if you have a bunch of babies. Oh yeah, yeah. You, you like, busy fucking so their lives up. Yeah, I, I, um, yeah, like I, I, I don't know, I don't know. I, Jordan, give me like a, a, a super like experimental g a gummy. Uh, a pie gummy. Super experimental. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How strong? Just now? Yeah, he you doubled my dose. He doubled. You, now? I trusted him. No, 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 no. Like yesterday. Oh, you seem pretty high now, though. Oh, no, no, but I have been drinking all day. Because, <laughs> no, I, I feel something's missing for me, so, like. <laughs> It's not poison. I, I know, it's I know. Poison. It's not poison. He's like, I don't know what's I, missing, but let's put poison in I was hole. high for like five hours, six hours. <laughs> I, I don't know. So like Less alcohol, more breathing. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, sorry, Alex. I don't mean that. Stand interrupt. up be comfortable. I don't need to see it. Stand up. Okay, yeah. I'm you're sorry. fine. Yeah, you're okay. good. You good? Yeah. Oh, let me yeah, check. Yeah. Let me turn the camera on. Hold on. Let me see.